Hey guys, it's your girl Mo. So I did a welcome. You know what? I'm gonna treat you like if you come into my house. I don't just say, okay, so yeah, we were just this woo woo woo. Okay, so sorry, rewind. Hello and welcome, new subscribers. Welcome back, returning subscribers. And if you know what that button could be fun, I'll show you how in this video. It's a challenge right now for me. It's everything that I planned. It's like, okay, yeah. That's not going to happen exactly how I wanted it, but maybe it would be even better than I originally imagined. Um, okay, so. If you don't know, this is a cash stuffing envelope video. A cash envelope stuffing video. And I have my new envelopes from Sergey and Co. I'll link it below. This is the... I had one of these in my January video, but I didn't put the little amounts on there. I'm like, oh, wow. So, it's actually here being sold. That's awesome. Okay, so. I have $500 here. So, that's what we're working with. These are the envelopes along with the registers. So, I'm making the envelopes for right now. Will it change? By the next time I do a cash stuffing envelope video, the probability is very high. <laughs> but for right now, this is how it's going. This will be rent and light, the rent and electric envelopes. So I'll just put that here. Rent and electric. I'll get that later. Okay. So rent and electric right now is going to put in the 280. So, let's count it out. It's kind of sticky, but 20, 40, 60, 81. 20, 40, 60, 82. 20, 40, 60, 80. Huh. I'm a pro. I put out the exact amount I needed. No, oh, but, um,. I'm only stuffing 20s. So I find myself stuffing only 20s a lot, but because I just went to the ATM, I couldn't get to the branch yesterday. What was I doing? I didn't go to the bank yesterday. Uh, the next one. This is the next one. Allowance. For allowance, I think I'll do 40. And I hope everyone's budget is going well. That's 20 and that's 40 into the allowance envelope. But yes, I did a video all about um, my budget. But yeah, this is, I did the video. And it's still loading. I don't know what's wrong with that one. But this is basically what I did on the other video. So, the May budget from the 1st to 15th. My income was at 500. Anything over that would be in savings. I think it was like 588. So, I'm only working with 500. The 88 would be in savings. And that was for May 3rd. I'm doing rent 280 on the phone. Electric, I already paid with my debit card. And then cable, I'll be paying with the card. So, what I'm stuffing will be phone. So that'll be 20 and 40 and 60, 80, 100. And that will go to phone, which is right here. Just write the phone on there. Phone went into. Until further notice, I'll probably have to downsize one of those phones, or either just get a new phone. But for right now, phone one and two. Next thing I'm stuffing, and the reason why I don't know about the next check is because I was starting, but then they moved back the orientation date. I will be going back to school. This was my wake up call. If I was playing around before. I'm done playing around and making excuses or whatever it was that I was doing, whatever I was doing, <laughs> trying to make sense of not just going so I can 
upgrade my income, upgrade my lifestyle to do something that I'm passionate about. So, with these two, I'll just make these sinking, or, yeah, with these two, I'll make these sinking funds. I have sinking fund envelopes. Oh, and I do have some more money left. Yay. So, I put all my leftover money in this gift envelope. This was from, it might be a little bit from, check one of May because mostly this is what was left over from April so let's see what we have we have 20 30 40 50 60 61 2 63 64 65 whoops 65 hold on how do I do some math 25 there's my phone 6 so I have $90 to work with. I'm going to have to call them back in a minute. <laughs> I want to finish up with this. Let me see. Okay, so $90 was left to... Okay, so with this, you already know. One fives and pins, I'm going to put that towards the savings challenge. I'll update that in another video. For the 40, I'll just put 20 in. Okay, for medical, dental, and vision, I'll just stuff that on in the next week or two weeks. Right now, this is all about the cash envelope. So, these two will each get 20, but what will they be? Let me see. Um, I guess I need to do cable, but I'm doing it with a card. And basically, let's see, household. I'll make this household. $20. That one is household. These envelopes are gorgeous, by the way. And this last one with the $20. Because uh, I have rainy day already. So, yeah, rainy day is right here. Uh, rainy day has some money in it. Blessings. Blessings. Okay, so. We're going to take this out. That rainy day had money, which is good because rainy days they do come. I'm gonna put this 20 in rainy day and then move that over singles over to the savings and stuff that later on. So that's rainy day, $20. I think we got everything. Upgraded the household envelope. So this one is to be determined. I'll do that one later on. So that was 90. Let's see how much is in rainy day. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that was a hundred. And I made that my savings goal is somewhere here. I'll show you in another video, but I reached my savings goal of 100 for the month. Hopefully, I won't have to dip into it. But thanks, guys, for watching the video. That's all for now. And for laundry, I'm not stuffing laundry because. Laundry is here, and let me just let me show you that I still have. I actually need to tell you this is more. Yeah, that's a plenty for at least two weeks. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Let's watch your money grow. Take care.